in this video, we're going to talk about these amazing Kushu products. The X43 in one foldable magnetic wireless charger and that X27 Pro iPad magnetic stand with wireless charging. Now we are going to explore and learn more about its functions and we are also going to talk about some amazing features these product provides. Roll that intro. <laughs> Mabuhay tasters, welcome to Taste Visuals. If you're new to this channel and you're kind of interested in filmmaking, techie reviews, and digital art, this is the channel for you. And be sure to subscribe and tap that bell there so you'll get notified whenever I uploaded a new video. To all of my current subscribers, thank you so much for your support and you guys are awesome as always. And please don't forget to follow me on my other social media accounts for more videos, updates, and tips. All right, before anything else, I would like to thank Kushu Tech for sending me these bad boys to review. Now, what I'm about to share to you, Tasers, is based on my honest opinion, and I'm not paid to do this video. So let's get down to business. Now let's start with the X40. It came with a case, a charger, and a USB-C cable. Now the Kushu X40 is crafted with aluminum alloy, and it is noticeable upon touching it. It feels premium, and it is fairly lightweight definitely portable and pocketable now it can be a stand like this or you can just lay it flat like this you can charge your iphone airpods and apple watch simultaneously and it supports ios 17 so you can set your iphone to standby mode and i'd say it's a really neat looking design to be honest it also has a 5 watt charging capability it can charge your iphone from 0 to 100 percent in two hours it supports other devices such as the following. Now this is based on their website. However, I don't have this model to test. But what I'm sure is that this is compatible with iPhone 12 to iPhone 15. Now you can charge your iPhone without a case or with a MagSafe case like this. Now for the X27 Pro. Upon opening, the first thing I got is the magnetic aluminum detachable panel, the neck of the stand, the wireless charging base plate, a USB-C cable, an instruction manual, and a few screws to assemble it. Now the assembly is easy yet finicky if you ask me. So I tried to put the charging cord first and to be honest, it was a bit hard because of how the port was placed, but I still managed to connect it somehow. But frankly, I was a bit scared though, thinking that by putting too much force and pressure on the cord might have damaged it but it didn't so i am glad to say that it's still working and it is a relief now put the screws at the bottom to attach the neck tighten it with the included allen key now the magnetic plate it has some sticker guides i did remove it but it's optional all right for the last step just align the back slot to the neck and then screw it tightly after that you're good to go now you can attach your ipad without a case of course also the magnetic plate is adjustable you can tilt it rotate it based on your usage now that we are familiar with these two let's talk about some of its perks and quirks now for the ease of use both x40 and the x27 pro is really easy to use once it's set up and plugged in all you need to do is slap in your device and it works like a charm. For the build quality and design, aesthetic wise, these two are definitely elegant and sleek looking, complementing Apple products' sophisticated look. Also, these two are definitely durable and sturdy. The X40 hinge are really tight and secure. The magnet also holds my iPhone 13 Pro Max and iPhone 15 Pro Max really well. And it goes the same with the X27 Pro, which handles my iPad Pro 11 inch M2 really well. Functionality, both the X40 and the X27 Pro works great by design. And I never experienced any compatibility issues with the Apple devices that I got. The X40 is definitely making my desk look neat with its unique design while charging my Apple devices. Especially when I set my iPhone to standby mode, it's just 
On the other hand, I use my X27 Pro and my iPad Pro as a second monitor for my MacBook Pro 14 inch by a sidecar. And man, my iPad Pro is looking like a baby Apple monitor, which is, I find really cool. And I'm also satisfied with it. And it's really doing its job well. Plus with the extra wireless charging, understand is definitely a plus. If ever my wife needs to charge her iPhone or AirPods, very nice. For the quirks, uh, the X40 is can be a bit hot while charging all three devices, but it didn't bother me that much. And I had no problems from the past two months, three months of using it. But I guess it is to be expected because it produces power. For the X27 Pro, maybe in the future version, the magnetic plate can also charge my iPad Pro wirelessly. <laughs> that will be a very neat feature and really helpful. Overall, I am impressed with both of these uh, Kyushu products and I'm really satisfied with its functionality and it just works. So I will definitely recommend this to all of the iPhone and iPad users. Charging all of your Apple devices in one device and making your desk look awesome. Kushutech got your back. I will leave the links in the description below, so go check them out. And that's it, Tasers. I hope you found this video helpful. If you want more videos like this, please consider subscribing and tap that bell there so you get notified whenever I uploaded a new video. And again, Tasers, this is Taste Visuals. And together, let's explore, learn, create, and share. I'll see you on my next video. Taste Visuals. Out. Kushu Products, Tasers. Kushu Products. I forgot to mention the the one that been that I've been talking about earlier. This one, the the bottom connection for the X27 Pro is a bit you know finicky. In my own opinion, they should just remove this. I know they created this to protect the cord, but it's really hard to, you know, connect the cord in this position because I'm going to have to put too much pressure on pushing this so that it would connect on the USB-C port in there. But maybe for some people, they might find it hard to, you know, to connect this and, you know, they might put too much pressure on the cord, making the cord unusable or they might damage the internal uh coils inside so yeah i hope they change the design of this